I believe that one of the major challenges to global or holistic change in Jewish education specifically is the fragmentation of the Jewish world. And I'm wondering from your perspective if you really think it's realistic that we can get at one table to move and to, to perpetuate any sort of sustaining change, the Tara Masora, the YU, the Agudas all together, or whether we can effectuate more sustainable change if we actually accept the fragmentation that exists in perspective and we really deal with each group. So what, what I think it connects, thank you for the point and thank you for the question. I think um, just about four years ago, um, I, was, I, was, I was in a hospital and I was uh, having a chest x-ray because I, I got pneumonia. So I told my doctor, I, I can't stay in the hospital. He wanted to check me in. I said, no, I can't stay. He says, life-threatening. I said, I can't stay. I said, I can't stay because in an hour, I need to be standing on a podium welcoming 650 educators to the North American Jewish Day School Conference. I have to welcome 650 Jewish educators from the reform movement, from the conservative movement, from the Schechter network, from the Ravsak, the Community Day School Network, and Orthodox schools that are affiliated with YU, 650 strong, more than had ever come to any conferences of any of those individual organizations, came together in Teaneck, New Jersey four years ago because we got together to say we can do better if we build a better system together. We can look at a field. We can start building a field. Now, four years later, we've had four of these, and that conference has grown to 1,000 people. I wanted to be at the podium welcoming everybody to that conference because that was, that was a pivotal point in Jewish history that my children need to know I was there because it was about integrating something that naturally should be because we have so many more commonalities than we have differences. So many more. So, yes, I believe it's possible. I believe it's possible because I've lived it. I believe it's possible because I, I have people in my office from all denominations who are working every single day to advance the learning of children in schools. Every single day. Cross-denominationally. Because that's what we believe in, it's what we value, and it's what we do. And there are many people who value this in our community and we need to bring them together also.